Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Legends of Aria. I think we have the staticky sound worked out, I hope. I did a test video and it seemed okay, so I figured we'd do this quick and uh, just chit chat for a little bit. And you can check out my mage, working him. These are his skills. Trying to make him a uh, bard mage. Problem is, I, I mean, I had to set. Because I have seven skills, I had to go Evocation and Affinity at 100, but then everything else at 80, so I don't know. I'll probably change some stuff then later. But, uh, because I wanted to be able to, to do my Masteries, which, wrong one. To do that, I needed, like, Evocation, Manifestation, Affinity, and Channeling. I didn't want, initially didn't have Channeling because I can restore with my Bard skill, Song of Water. But, since I have to have it for this, I'm going to hold on to it for a little while until I at least hit the 80 Mastery. Because I think once you get them, you don't lose the skill. I think. Not positive. What happens if I... I don't think you do because Reaper had... Like, I, I still have access to his Sprint. And the... Uh, the now, granted, I don't. I've never untrained it because, like, you can train, like, right here under Mage. I can do Spell Chamber or Meditation if I have the ability points, which you get right here from just killing stuff. But I've never, like, you can only have one of each. So, like, I can only have one each of the Journeyman active at one time, and then one each of Master, and so on and so forth. So. I'm not sure what happens if I untrain it. We'll find it out, I guess. But uh, anyway, hopefully, sorry if I'm threatening out a little bit. My threat sound a little tired. Monday night, I worked like 10 hours today. So I'm a little beat down. Just relaxing. Having a couple of beers. I am of age. Obviously, I'm an old man. Uh, but yeah, don't don't drink if you're not 21. Anyway, just throwing that disclaimer out there. But no, seriously. But no, uh, so yeah, we'll work our mage here a little bit just for a quick short video. But the one reason I wanted to be bard was is the bard skills like Riddle of Havoc. Like if you watch, like let's see here. Uh, my ruin, or, uh, what is this? Ruin. We'll do... That did 12. Now, that spell, the closer he is, the more damage it does. So that's 53. So there's 50, 53, 52. Okay. Now, watch what happens when I get Riddle of Havoc off. If we get it off. And, yeah, we didn't. Of course not. Because I wanted to. Just nuke his ass. Anyway, keep in mind those numbers were like in the 50, like 53, 50, and so on. Alright, so we will get it all. God. See, here's the problem is it my entertainment's at 80. At 80. My music, my musicianship is at almost 80. Basically, musicianship. Is my ability to play an instrument well, which is essentially being able to play it. But entertainment is essentially the damage, is the way I'm figuring it works. Like, you know what I mean? So, problem is, I think it, at maybe 80 of musicianship, it's, it, my getting an off is going to not be great. So, you know what I mean? But, uh,. Hopefully, I can get it up there. Oh, that nuked him. But we're going to see here in a minute. If we get it off. There we go. All right, now watch the damage. Ruin 103. Yeah, that's why I like being a bard mage. 
definitely works out real well. Now it lasts for 10 seconds, which doesn't seem like long, but it's a decent amount of time. But anyway, you know, so. See, I'm liking the mage. Definitely liking the mage. There we go. But I'm just trying to work my skills. About that, I'm back. Thank God, nothing attacked us. But yeah. Anyway. But yeah, so you see the damage difference there. It's, it's just insane. God. We should be able to get it off again. See, and what sucks is I gotta. I'm gonna have to dump something else. I really want to be able to take musicianship and entertainment to a hundred, but I can't do that. I can't do that with the with the build that I have. So I'm not sure what to do. I because obviously I want to be able to do my abilities. Uh, I could drop a tombman, but I don't want to. Here's why. Two mint on a mage. Let me show you. Uh, magical attunement determines your ability to augment your casting with magical wands and staff. So essentially, if I use, if I equip any kind of staff or wand, I get more damage out of my spells or more healing and so on and so forth. It, 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 it makes it augment, it makes it more powerful. And that includes healing and everything else. So it's nice to have. I mean, it really does do a shit ton more damage. Try this again. Oh, there we go. All right, now watch the damage. Yeah. I mean, it's so much more. It's just crazy. It's it's worth having being a bard. Now, hopefully at some point, they are adding a warrior-type book uh, with, with the next patch, which should be good. Because even Reaper, my basically my main, but like I had, he's Bard, he's a Bard Archer because the damage is a lot. You get it off, and, and you go from it's just double damage. It's insane, and that's at my currently crappy ability. So to, you know, I'm, you see where I'm going with that. But like, I don't need channeling because number one, I just got meditation. Uh, two minute cooldown sucks, and that's from that's from this right here. Okay, that is right there. Now, I could have taken the spell chamber, but I don't really need to store spell right now. So I definitely want to be able to do journeyman, and I want to be able to go to master for either one of these. I don't necessarily care about grandmaster. I mean, it'd be nice to have that, 
But I mean, I'd be willing to, if I don't lose them, like if I were to untrain that to get this once I get three points, and I but I don't have the required skills, I'm not sure if I keep that or not. So that's what's weird. I have to test it, which I can test it on Reaper. I know as long as you have it trained, you don't lose it. But like I said, I haven't untrained Reaper, so I don't know. That's the problem, I don't know. And I'll have to do some testing. Let's see. But like I said, I definitely want to keep the wand thing going. And I haven't been able to get that off. Which essentially renders all creatures, or has a chance to render them incapacitated. I'm, or I'm sorry, I have gotten it off, but I haven't, like, incapacitated it. So, it's hit or miss, I guess. It says has a chance, so it's not a guarantee. We really need some armor. Like, there's some nice mage ropes and stuff out there that I really want to get. Ruin actually does a good amount of damage. It really does. But yeah, I mean, I don't know. I've been farming on, on different characters, saving for my house. I mean, I have my plot. And it's like, it, I can't get it any wider than 14. But I can get it like long ways. Like, I don't know, up to like 30. So I, I can buy the biggest house. Like, each town sells a different size house for 19 platinum, 5,000 silver, or gold. Uh, but like, like Valis, the one that, for that price in Valis is 17 by, or I'm sorry, is 15 by 15. Now the one in, but the one in Helm is 17 by, I think, 13. It's essentially the same thing, obviously, but that the guy can fit on my lot. So I've been saving for that. I'm not really near it, but we're getting there. And right here, let's see. We're going to get this off, which is part of the bard. Hopefully it casts. Yes. Now this actually, this probably generates mana better than anything else. Faster than meditation, faster than focus. I mean, look at it go up. It's crazy. Plus, we almost have our intelligence to 50. That's the cap for, for each single ability or uh, stat. Uh, I'm going to try to keep my strength to 20 just for the extra weight. Here's a good example of I'll, like, I won't use my stat. Let's see what Ruin does. Ten. All right, up close. Forty-two. 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 Now we put the staff on and cast the same spell. Fifty-one. Fifty. So it's substantially higher. How is that thing broken already? I, I literally just got that. Ugh. Well, I have two more in the bank. I didn't goddamn bring one though, because I didn't think I'd need it. That's weird. I should have checked that, I guess. Get off me. That's what I'm talking about. That's the damage. But like, here's meditation. I mean, it doesn't do bad, but I still, I think the barred one is better. 
definitely feel like it is. Are they? Oh, I've never seen them attack a bat like that. That's kind of funny. Wow. They wrecked them. Oh, yeah. Now watch this. Oh, yeah. Did I get... See, that's a lot of damage. really want to GM him. Well, I can GM his evocation manifest or uh, affinity. Which again, evocation is essentially if I click the right one it's basically my ability to cast him. And affinity is my damage. So we definitely want to do that. And I'm not dumping the bard skills. That's not going to happen. Not going to happen. I mean, honestly, if I have to, I just I won't even worry about mastering. Just because I'll just you know I'd rather have the damage than the ability. So. You know, we dump, let's see, we have seven. So we dump channeling. We can take everything, everything to a hundred. So, and plus, if I dump it, like if I were to drag that to zero, it'll tell, it'll warn me that I'm going to lose the points. But then it'll still be highlighted in green, which means that it goes up three times faster for quite a while. So if I want to get channeling back, I can get, regain it. But I definitely want to be able to to cast my bard spells better. I saw. Because that's where the real damage is at. And I haven't gotten energy bolt off yet. I don't know. I, just, it's, I think it's a tier 7 spell, so I just don't think I'm high enough. Yep, there's the staff. Well, we gotta go to the bank. I mean, we don't need it, but, you know, I do wanna. I do wanna keep getting my attunement up, and I won't get that up without a staff on me. So, we want that. Hopefully, this video comes out okay. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure I worked it out. And I don't think I had the sounds too loud. I think I turned, I did turn like some of the sounds up a little bit, but uh, so you can hear the game. But yeah, having a blast, a lot of fun. Can't wait till they, till they do a patch, though. I mean, everybody loves new stuff. Come on. I also can't wait till I can take my mage and actually kill more than just these two spiders. But right now, I mean, I could go to the cemetery. But I'm not really going to get any more gold, but I'm not going to gain any more spell-wise. See, I think it works. I want to say, I mean, because I'm still gaining on these guys. So I want to say Majory works differently than, like, like Reaper's Archery. I stopped gaining off of certain creatures after certain levels. I mean, at pre-level 80, I had to go kill Hobgoblin. And then after the Hobgoblins, I had to go to, and I started killing the Drakes on the island where I live. Well, Peninsula, whatever. And then I got them up to like 97. But, the, but if you notice, like Majory, I'm still gaining everything just by casting. Which makes sense. Uh, but at the same time, you know, I mean, I would thought I would think it would work like archery or any other skill. Don't get me wrong; if I can keep killing low-level stuff and keep gaining, I'm fine with that. No problem with that at all. And since these in-town little dungeons are the lowest-level things, and I'm already over, you know, fifty, 
I feel like I'm still going to keep gaining. I mean, we'll find out, clearly. But I haven't yet. But yeah, right now, I mean, Majory is definitely OP. I gotta go get a staff. And I want to be able to get to the point where I can mark rooms and open, open gates. And it's not like UO, though, where I can get, like, Reaper, uh, a, 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 a recall book. At least not yet. Like, there's no recall scroll. So if you want to get it around, you basically have to. You basically have to be a mage. I almost want to grab that. What does that would affect when I do it? I don't know. We're going to find out. See, it just says it affects agility. Is that any other stat? No, just, just agility. Alright, let's see here. Let's grab that. Okay, good. All right, so let's throw some money in the bank here. You can type in and say bank. I actually have a macro on my mule that says bank. But for now, I've just been typing it in with him. Here's my reagent bag. Which, you know, I don't like that, that like, when you pick herbs up, like it doesn't automatically put them into there, but, uh, you know, you can deal with it. This I do have set as a loot bag. I don't need those. Another map. We got a lot of maps, but we did we dumped treasure hunting. Try to keep this as organized as possible for now. Right there. some gold little by little. And at some point they're going to activate the uh, announcement board, but not yet. Disabled for now, then the message as you see. Alright, we got that off. See, it goes up pretty quick. Yeah. So there's a look at my mage, Silver Dragon. Uh, I think we'll cut it there to get a little taste. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I really appreciate the. Uh, we've had a lot of views on the on the Aria stuff, and uh, I appreciate the support and like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And we will see you in Aria. Thanks.